Hey, this is Mirgloff, and this is the Hardcore Mode Flat World Challenge. And the goal is to get 80 gold ingots, of which I have 44, and to build with which those ingots to make 20 gold blocks to build a Minger Sponge, which is essentially a cube with uh, empty spaces throughout its sides and center. I believe I have an example somewhere near here at the base. P or perhaps I don't. But that's okay. At the exact moment I'm going to be getting rid of useless stuff such as this flesh. That. I don't really have any arrows. So I'll put this bow away. These boots are going to come ha in handy in a short while as my current ones are almost out. Here's my food. Don't need this. Let's see here. Let's reorganize my stuff a little better. All right. I do need more cobblestone, but uh, I'm gonna. I haven't quite made up my mind which direction I'm gonna head out, but it'll be a direction. Ugh, I don't want to pick all that up. But we're going to go back to this old familiar territory to get some more cobblestone. And I'll do that off camera. Unless I happen to die, then I will include that in the final cut of the video. Alright, and I've gathered a sufficient number of cobblestone. I also found some ender pearls. This might be useful at some point, I'm not sure when. This is pretty much what remains of the uh, that one church when one of my very first nights. I don't believe this was the first village I came across, but it was certainly one of the early ones. Uh, and before I head out, I'm going to grab some wheat here. Because I'm low on bread, as it turns out. And these iron golems don't really do much to protect me from slimes. So, they're not really particularly helpful in this challenge. But the flint and steel comes in a great... comes in very handy. In fact, I should have brought some uh, iron ingots with me. I left them in my base, but that's okay. I'm sure I'll encounter more iron ingots in random blacksmith loot chests. Kill this cow as well, he can give me some beef. I'll kill these cows too, and we'll just head off in this direction. Alright. Nope. Oh, I just realized that it's very quiet. Because there was rain earlier. That's a good amount of meat, but I'll go ahead and collect more from this cow here. Come on. There we go. We're going to go this way a little bit and then take a perpendicular direction. It's got to be a bit of a ways off, though, before I do that. I think on this next one, next block over here, I'll go ahead and turn in that direction. Try to make an arrow here. Ah, god damn it. Not really working out so well. These damned slimes. Alright. Ouch. Okay, and we're off. And I'm going to uh, cut out this part until I get to a new NPC village. Alright, here's a new village over here. Spiders. 
And I've traveled for about, I would say, two minutes, really. Not to particularly long. Oh, that's a dangerous situation right there. Glad I evaded it. I'll go up to there and we'll turn off here. I see one blacksmith so far. So other than, uh, obviously I play a lot of Minecraft. Well, that's a bothersome noise. Other than Minecraft, I play some games. I've been playing a little bit more variety of other games lately than I have been in the past couple of months. Such as I've been recently bought Fallout New Vegas for the PC. I had it for the console originally, but... I never played the DLC, so I bought the Ultimate Edition. And, uh, I also played a little bit of, uh, Skyrim from now, uh, now and again. There's another blacksmith over here. And, uh, I like Binding of Isaac, too. I don't play a whole lot of it, but it's fun. I've beaten... Mom, and I've beaten Mom's heart. I can see this here. I don't really see another blacksmith. I also played a little bit of uh, Borderlands. Mostly because I'm uh, eager for Borderlands 2. Uh, I'll probably... I am going to do videos of that when it comes out, a walkthrough. But I believe it comes out in September, so that's... Plenty of time before that happens. Probably, I think it's like six months from September from now. Not sure. It looks interesting. And I enjoyed Borderlands 1. The original Borderlands wasn't really what I expected it to be, but... I still had fun. It was worth my money. And I'm going to go off to the next NPC village now as I've done before. Alright, here's another village. I don't immediately see any blacksmiths. Yeah. I'm gonna take uh maybe take refuge in one of these churches if I can find some wool. I should have brought at least three wool with me. But I didn't. That was a foolish mistake. Wasn't quite prepared for this uh, excursion, but that's okay. And yeah, I'm not seeing any blacksmith. I just gotta find my uh, orientation from where I was before. I think what I was saying before. Oh, here's some wool. I can make a bed. Oh, and ah, crap. Sorry for being quiet there and just concentrating. Crap. Dang. I think what I was saying before, I was talking about games that I'm uh, anticipating, which really I'm only anticipating Borderlands uh, 2. I know there's uh, Guild Wars 2 possibly coming out. And, oh, that's right, I need that wool. And some other games, but I, I never played Guild Wars. Uh, I don't know if I should. I have a lot of people. I know a lot of people are excited for it. The uh, the Guild Wars 2, that is. And uh, I'm actually kind of glad that the uh, in the next year or so that I don't have any games that look really good to me. I, I know that sounds strange, but uh, I kind of like it, like having a Oh, wow, that's... I like having a pace set where I find one really good game each year. And this is not a good place to be, actually. Dang it. Each year, sort of like if I uh, found Minecraft. world. 
sort of like I found Minecraft and other games in the past. And uh, it gives me time to uh, play games that I've already... I still enjoy, but I haven't... ...gotten to play as much as I would like. I played Minecraft quite a lot, so I don't feel as though I haven't played it as much as I'd like. But there's other games that I've uh, bought recently that I'd like to have more time to play, such as Civilization 5. How do I not have three wool? Dang it. Such as Civilization 5 and uh, uh, others I can't really think of off the top of my head. I'd like to spend more time playing, and uh, just having a bunch of really awesome games come out at once just kind of stockpiles for me. I think that's all I have to say about that. I just need to find one more bit of, bit of wool. I don't know what happened to that third. Well, it's irrelevant now. I was trying to make it day. But, uh, so anyways, my, uh, plans on how to continue this is that when I next... I'm going to keep on going in this direction. Damn. This direction. Until I find enough obsidian to make another portal and use that to make another nether journey back to the Flat World HQ central portal and then uh, start that process over again killing zombie pigments on the way so just so that I can switch things up oh there's another village we'll uh, end this video with this village here just switch things up so that uh, when one sort of method for collecting gold ingots begins to become tedious and uh, boring essentially not necessarily boring but you know ten videos in a row of me just running in one direction is f certainly not interesting and I'll probably well I will be uh, sort of like I did earlier in this video just get a little bit topical talking about stuff like games I'm excited for I guess just to keep it interesting I suppose sort of I do do my job as an entertainer I suppose not really a job but my hobby I would say is more accurate uh, I've got too much stuff that I do not need at all so I gotta take care of that immediately and I want to collect another bit of wool I should craft that into should put these on. Let's craft that wheat into bread. I will check this blacksmith as well, though. I did find a gold ingot. That's that's good. I was not thinking I was going to find a gold ingot. Whoa! I was not thinking I was going to find any gold ingots this video, but I found a bunch. That's pretty cool. Off to a good start. Let's hope it will stay a streak. So where is a crafting bench? One of these houses. I think they're called libraries. Oh, let's see relevant. I think there's a skeleton in here. There's not. Let's make another bench here. We'll just craft this into bread. All right. Oh, one more. So that does it f that for this video. Thanks for watching and there will be more to come soon. See ya.